Hey guys, and today I have the Mariah Carey launch collection video, whatever you guys want to call it. Mariah Carey collection video. I haven't bought everything, I've just bought the things that I know I'm going to use and I like and I'm interested in. I've bought more than I was going to get. I was only going to get about three items. So I'm going to be reviewing, swatching and showing you all the products I have bought. First things first, I've took every single piece of makeup from this range out of its packaging so I don't have to film the struggle of me opening it on camera so this video will hopefully be a lot shorter than they normally are when I'm struggling in it hopefully <laughs> can you believe it is only three days till Christmas three days time we'll be sitting around the table eating yummy food and opening presents and I just can't wait to see on my family's face when they open their presents that's what I love about Christmas it's just it brings me joy so the first thing I'm going to start off with are the eyeshadow quads. So the eyeshadow quads are I'm That Chick You Like and It's Everything. These are both of the quads that Mariah Carey has released in her new Christmas MAC collaboration collection whatever. The quad I was determined to get was I'm That Chick You Like. However, I think I like this one more and I wasn't going to pick this one up. I picked up this first and I have to say I'm a little disappointed with this shade in particular it's called Golden Petals Scattering I knew these palettes were going to have shimmer in it but this one particular has a lot of fallout I suggest patting it on rather than using any tool to blend it I found that when I blended it the, there was a lot of fallout so, like you need a flat brush you might even be able to use Fix Plus with this particular shade these two shades, however, are gorgeous, and I have to say, I love this brown. This brown matte shade is stunning. It's perfect for like a smoked out gold eye. I think this shade might be my favourite. This one's called Can't Escape Me, and the matte shade is called How You Thrill Me. So I think those two are stunning together. This quad is carefully thought out because these shades would all go together beautifully. So this palette is called It's Everything. I think this has to be my favourite quad out of the two just because the shades in here are gorgeous. I also got to mention that it's a magnetic closure. Again, this palette does have one shade that has a lot of fallout and that would be this one at the top, top right and this one's called Diamond Butterfly. It is a gorgeous shade though, it is a stunning shade. This bottom right, which is called Twinks is absolutely freaking amazing. It's like a burnt burgundy orange plum shade, like it's like all into one. It's just a really nice warm shade. Next we have is the Sweet Sweet Fantasy Blush. There was two blushes in her collection. I'm not sure what the other one was called, but it was more of a pink. However, I love this shade. They all have a hint of glitter in it, but it does not show on the cheeks. But it's like a, a mauvey pink with a coral hint to it. I really love this shade. It's gonna be perfect for the summer. It blends so nicely, it's so smooth, I love it. Then we have this beauty. This is the number one thing on my freaking list when the Mariah Carey range came out. This is called My Mimi. So this is an extra dimension skin finish. And one look at it, you're thinking like, for people who have got fair skin, what the hell are you gonna use this for? But I have tried this out, I could use it for pretty much anything. I could use it as a highlighter very finely, eyeshadow, I could even mix it in with my bronzer. I just really, really love this. I was gonna pick up two, but I thought no, because what happens if you pick up one and you don't even use it and it's really gold and you're not sure if you're gonna suit this tone, color, but no, I honestly love it. It's so nice and so pigmented and just stunning. As you can see on my swatch, it's just heaven. Heaven, guys. It's beautiful. I went into the MAC store and I wanted to try out the lipsticks and the lip pencils. There's two lip pencils. There's a brown one and then there was this one which is called New Ombre. It's this gorgeous pale coral. It's like a, a light coral. Nude shade and oh my goodness. I fell in love with it. Like, I was like, I've got to get this as well now. By the way guys, I've never bought a lip pencil from MAC and now I'm contemplating why I've never actually done that before. Why have I never bought a lip pencil from MAC? 
these things are amazing. I had a really nice assistant approach me and she said, I'm more than welcome to apply a lipstick once you're ready, once you've chosen one. And I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, I'm up for that. I chose this lipstick, which is McKizzle, which is a cream sheen. And I love cream sheen's formula, but this one I absolutely love. And she applied this first. And as soon as she applied it, I was like, this colour really looks, it really suits me. I love this colour. She then put this over the top and oh my gosh, it was the best winning combination. I was like, I want this, I want this and I want the blush. Can I just purchase everything right now? So yeah, I picked up this lipstick. I have tons of lipsticks and I don't have like a coral brown pinky nude shade. It's like the perfect nude shade. I love it. And one thing I really do love about Mariah Carey's lipsticks is the butterfly on the friggin lipstick it's just so cute can you see that i just think that's amazing attention to detail 100 percent oh my gosh mari carey this range is stunning but yeah i love this lipstick and you just really want the lipsticks because of the packaging really i mean this whole range is just packaging 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 in your face last but not least i picked up one more lipstick a few days after the launch because last year i didn't pick up mariah carey's signature all i want lipstick and the fact that she re-released it in this collection just meant that i had to get it not only is it in this glittery new silver packaging it's got a butterfly on it as well and i just could not pass it up i mean last year i didn't get it because i was just a little bit too late and it's just gorgeous and every time every time i go to pick this up or when i apply it i'm just like all i want for christmas is you literally I do. I think this collection is kind of getting us ready for summer even though summer's not here yet but it's also very festive as well especially the packaging. I love this whole range and I've been waiting for it for months. This is just like the Star Trek range. I've been telling all my friends like what are you gonna get? Are you gonna get anything? Like I'm saving all my money up for this. I can't do this because I've got this Mariah Carey range coming out and I just want to spend all my money on it. It's just it's I was actually getting so nervous that I wasn't going to get any of it, but I was so happy I did. It's three days till Christmas, I cannot wait, and I'm probably going to get a ton more makeup. I've just literally cleared out my closet of makeup and rearranged everything, so that's just going to go right down the drain as soon as, as soon as I see what I get for Christmas. If I get any makeup for Christmas, I might not, so yeah. That is everything. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel and comment below. I love you guys and, well, Merry Christmas. Bye. I'm happy to apply it. Dr. Pepper, if you've got it. All I want for Christmas is you, you, baby. I don't know why I sing at the end of these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel. It's for the left hand, Kate. What are you doing? He said, yeah. Okay.